It's hard to believe another year is wrapping up at the City Rest Commission of Lansing, meeting needs in our community. Uh, it's also hard to imagine that we're starting our 111th year of ministry in Michigan's capital area. And so we're so thankful to see how God has protected and provided for us throughout 2021. Uh, I do see the needs continue to grow. Our numbers are actually have exceeded pre-COVID numbers. And uh, so we are sheltering uh, about 200 men, women, and kids each night right now. So at our two shelter locations plus our drop-in center, uh, we're pretty regularly exceeding 200 people each evening. And so one of our greatest needs right now is uh, staff, uh, full-time and part-time staff, but also volunteers. As you can imagine, uh, the number of people that we serve, uh, it is busy in the evening, every night of the year, plus weekends. And so we're looking for help to help us serve meals and meet needs uh, in the evening from about 5 p.m. to about 9 p.m. And uh, so we're looking for people to help serve meals, uh, to help watch the kids, uh, to help meet, uh, meet needs as well. So. Uh, if you're willing, uh, come to our website, berescue.org, uh, click on the volunteer form, or just call 517-485-0145 and talk to our volunteer coordinator. Uh, we're looking forward to 2022, and uh, we are actually raising funds and awareness for our men's ministry. Uh, we are sheltering uh, just a little over 70 men each evening. Uh, we do expect that need to grow, and we're hoping within a couple of years we're going to be able to expand to 120 beds on Michigan Avenue for men, as well as our single room occupancies for men. And we do see that uh, a, a creative way of meeting needs in our community, and you're a major part of making that happen. So I just ask you to pray and consider how can you help uh, be a rescuer in 2022.